Rover's Mayday Maze is back, and this time there's a new reward waiting at the end. Let's teach you exactly how to beat this maze 100% in 7 minutes or less. How's it going everyone? It's Abdali here bringing you guys another awesome Animal Crossing New Horizons tips and tricks tutorial video. Today's video is showcasing everything you need to know about the brand new May Day Maze, which is going to be a limited time event in order to get one of two of the brand new items within the game. So thanks so much for watching. If you guys didn't already, hit that subscribe button. Make sure you guys do so. It only takes one quick second and we are on our way to 1 million subscribers. Shout outs to the most recent subscribers that we have on board. You guys are absolutely amazing. Thank you so much for your contributions and enjoying all the content. Anyway, speaking of content, let's take a look on my main channel page over here. We've got tons of Animal Crossing tips and tricks tutorial videos that I want you guys to take a look at, especially the one where we live streamed the entirety of the brand new 1.10 update. So definitely take a look at that. And last but not least, since we are talking about Rover and we are talking about May Day, I definitely want you to take a look at our brand new merch launch that we just put out. We've got a very awesome sticker reminiscent of that, and uh, if you take a look, there's a really cute little Easter egg on there. Anyway, there's tons of brand new merch. If you guys want to save 10% off, use the code MAYDAY10 at checkout. Okay, here we go, ladies and gents, the May Day Maze. We're gonna show it on the fastest way possible. I think you can do it in less than five minutes. Put the timer on right now and see what we got. So Mayday Maze 2021 is gonna be relatively easy. Um, yeah, just follow my lead and it's gonna be the same for everyone. And then we're gonna find out what exactly we get from Rover whenever we do so. It should be really, really good. All right, let's go, let's eat this. All right, here we go, get ready. So this maze, if you take a wrong turn, you will be able to uh, like lose. You're gonna soft lock yourself from the entire maze and you don't want to do that. Um, so that being said, just kind of go through with it. We're already like one minute in, huh? Okay, pretty easy. All right, so now we don't have enough cherries, but if you come this way, we're gonna get some more cherries and we're gonna have to go all the way back around again in order to get even more. It's a lot of back and forth and ultimately in this maze, you're going to need to craft the specific, um, the specific ladder. So anyway, it should be good. Let's go. So Mayday Maze, yeah, here we go, starting May 1st. So take a look at it, doing, running across, here we go, grabbing this. And then if you remove this, we should be able to go south and get a couple more cherries. Mm-hmm, done. And we just opened up the crafting table that way. Hey, hey, welcome, welcome, here we go. We're gonna come back around. We don't necessarily need to go that way yet for that one rock, even though it's very tempting in order to get that stuff, so. Here we go, coming back around this way. Super simple. We're gonna do the eating of these two cherries and we're set. Done. Okay, we're gonna eat cherries. I wish there was like a quick way of eating cherries, but that's not. All right, easy. Done, done. Here we go, one, two. Here we go, boom, you're all set. Okay, um, doing this loop-de-loop -loop over here allows us to grab one more soft wood right over this way, allows us to grab this cherry and then two more of these regular woods. And remember that rock that we were talking about earlier? The rock is where we're gonna go back to. So coming all the way back around, very simple. And uh, we're gonna get the extra credit too, which is really fun, so in case you guys need some bells, but I know that you guys are playing Animal Crossing and a lot of you guys have millions of bells, so it's not really something that you may need, but it's there. Okay, here we go, easy. All right, we're gonna eat this. Dang, about two and a half minutes up. Yeah, Mayday Maze, relatively easy. One, two. I like it because you get to craft. And any kind of maze is where you get to craft something uh, that's not necessarily RNG related. I'm in. Pity ladder. <laughs> All right, so now that we got regular ladder, uh, we're not gonna keep on crafting because we don't have anything else, so that's a little bit waste of time right over there. All right, so now that we have said ladder, we're gonna climb up over here and we're gonna get an ax that, is, that it only has enough durability to break down one tree. So we need to make sure that we use that wisely. So we're gonna go all the way across here 
And by doing so, we're gonna go and hit that one tree that's over in the middle lane. Bow, bow, bow. Easy, easy. Okay, this is the axe. One, two, three. Done. And it poofs away out of existence. All right, you can use your shovel to dig this thing out, or you could sit on it and spin, whatever you want to do. Sit on it and spin, he says. All right, deal. All right, so now that we got these two, what we can do now is head out of here. If you want, you can go and uh, get rid of that, um, that rid of that tree, and then you can go see Mr. Uh, <laughs> Mr. Rover right now if you really wanted to. All right, so going this way allows us even more cherries. Hey, hey, there we go. So this is gonna be the 100% way. But at that moment, like I said earlier, you can easily go see Rover if you wanted, so. All right, here we are, here we are, let's go. All right, easy peasy. We're gonna go over here, grab three of these. Mayday maze. One, two, three. Done. Okay, easy. We're gonna cut over here. Rover, Rover, look at that. That's like right on the five minute mark. Yeah, for 100 percenting, Oh, I'm sorry, I'm going the wrong way. For 100%ing, you could probably do it in like maybe seven minutes or so. Less than 10 minutes, for sure. All right, digging this out, because I have another cherry. Yung, 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 yung. Easy. All right, so now I've got more cherries in my pocket. I'm ready to go, but of course, uh, we're not gonna go say hi to Rover just yet. We made it to Rover in like about five and a half minutes. You could definitely cut it shorter, but you guys want to 100% it, right? That's why you're here. Uh, so let's take out this. Let's go get our Bells tickets. And if you guys did the maze optimally, then you should have more cherries that you can go break some more stuff and then collect every single ticket within the area. So that being said, we're gonna eat some of these. And then come back to Rover with 100% and then we're gonna hit time. Easy, man. All right, one, done, one, two, easy, easy. And then we're gonna go all the way down here. What if there was a 100% reward from Rover and out of nowhere, like he's like, oh, hey, I didn't realize that you have all of these bell vouchers in your pocket. You collected them all, amazing job. What if, dude? All right, here we go, done, one, two, Three, four, five. Done. That's it. That's 100%. You have nine tickets. All right. Nine tickets in your inventory. And now we go to Rover and we're going to find out what he gives us for the perfect Mayday maze. And we're going to hit time right at like seven minutes. Easy. Dude, we're done. What's up, Robes? And time. Hey, you. Wow. What are the chances we meet like this again? Congrats on making it to the end, by the way. It's been a while, hasn't it? How have you been doing? Ah, uh, it's been tough, but I'm doing great, thank you. I'm really glad to hear that. It makes me think we'll uh, both still be smiling next time we run into each other. Wouldn't that be great? Hey, I think I'm gonna write you a letter later. It's always fun to keep in touch. I think I'm gonna write you a letter later. Okay, cool. You know, I think I'll hang on this island a little longer. I like it here. Okay. Tom Nook has really made a name for himself. Not bad for a guy who used to own a little more than an apron. Hmm, he's gonna mail me a letter, eh? Uh, it's nice to take a plane every once in a while. I'm used to traveling by train. Riding the rails, as they say. Wow. Were you able to finish the maze like you wanted, by the way? If you want to restart, you can do so by using the Rescue Services app. Yo, riding the rails, this guy. Rover. Uh, did you enjoy the maze? I sure did. And what better way to end it with, uh, than with our fateful meetup in that spirit? I'd like to mark our moment with a memento, a photo of me on my travels. Take care out there. <gasps> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Is it an NPC photo? Rover's photo. Wow. 
Oh, dude, that's so cool. That's absolutely cool. I love that. Uh, the very first reward that you're going to get is if you've never visited Rover before, so this is all of you guys that have not done the May Day event in the previous year, your reward is going to be this briefcase over here. It's Rover's briefcase. It's super awesome. It's great. Now, if you've already done that in 2020, and this is your second time seeing Rover, the dialogue is going to be slightly different, and you're going to receive Rover's picture. As of right now, it's really hard to tell whether or not you can get both of them. I tried my hardest to get the briefcase and the entire picture, but it seems like it's just based off of how many times you've talked to him with that specific character. So that being said, if you guys didn't already update your game, make sure that you hold off on the update. If you guys are a traditional player, I think maybe now's the time to go back to May and then attempt to see Rover and do your entire Mayday Maze for 2020, and then time travel back to the present time, update your game, and then do the maze again. By doing so, you'll be able to get both these items. Now, if you don't do that and you already updated your game and you're a first time Rover over here, you're not going to be able to get the photo. So it's kind of weird. You're going to be perpetually locked out of content unless you find a way of trading with someone. So anyway, just throwing that uh, little disclaimer out there. It's an interesting one. So anyway, here's the solution to the seven minute maze. Okay, well, there you have it. May Day 2021. Let me know what you guys think about it in the comment section below. Was it easy? Did you have to use this guide? Was it hard? Did you struggle with it? Did you enjoy it? Was the reward worth it? Can't wait to hear everything you guys think about in the comment section below. And also, let me know if you guys are first time Mayday players, how do you guys feel about not having the ability to get the photo right away? Interesting, right? Anyway, to be up to date with all the latest and greatest Animal Crossing content, hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. We've got tons more on screen over here to get yourself caught up. And other than that, we'll see you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching. Take care.